Hello, everyone, and welcome to episode, I think, 15 of our Pokemon Diamond Let's Play. Missed another upload on Saturday. So, the MDBL semi-finals were on Saturday, and I kind of needed to battle in those. Um, I won't spoil what happened, but we're getting a video next week. And, um, okay, that's a spoiler, never mind, I guess I will spoil what happened. We won. I'm ecstatic. But, we're going to finals. But the battle took way too long to schedule, and I had a very busy weekend. I've had a very busy whole week. I mean, we're all locked inside yet. I somehow find myself doing way more things. Like, unavoidable things. Anyway, um, answer the question of the day, which I'm going to come up with right now. Um, what's your... Like, do you prefer hot or cold? Because I prefer cold, and right now it's very hot. We're coming up to the summer solstice. And I have to suffer for you guys in this video. Everything in my room is closed off because outside we got lawn mowers and things. But anyway, if you remember last time, I think it was last time, we got Finneon, our newest member of the team. Who I'm going to put up front because Finneon needs to level up. And I've already fought you. This is a double battle here. But there seems to be a lot of, like, cool stuff going on here. Um, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to just carry on this route. Um, I think we need to double back to Heart Home City to take on the gym, I think. Or we can take it on right now and I'm just wrong. I don't know. It's been a while since we've taken on a gym. We need to take one on pretty soon. Bonsley and Mime Junior, that's actually a really decent start. Um, because Pinion is ready. And Quinion can take out Bonsley, and Straving can take out Mime Jr. Just fine. And all the stats are lowered. Um, I'm definitely getting to bond with this team more, which I like. Um, so I have this thing where I'm trying to play through a lot of Pokemon games right now, because when school starts, I'm not going to be able to play through them as often. And I waste too much time on Reddit. I want to do something slightly productive, and playing through these games feels more productive than going on Reddit the whole time. It probably isn't. But anyway, we're gonna water gun Bonsley and we attack the Mime Junior. So anyway, um with playing through the games, I was trying to play through them all eight nth generations in a go, like in any order, but the eight without repeating one, then do that again. So that way I don't end up playing through one generation a bunch, then leaving out another one. But a problem arose, playing through this, I can only of course play about half an hour a day. And, um, it's taken me a while to get through this game. And I've already played for, like, I'm on the third game of a different gen that I've been playing through while doing this, so. We've got a ways to go, it would seem. Um, also, I didn't check what Finion's ability was, because Finion can get a really cool ability. Okay, so this Bonsley does resist this attack, but it should get us low enough for Finion to knock it out. Hopefully. There we go, the deed is done. The Bonsley is dead. I have used the Pseudo Rudo, but I used it in Gen 2 before Bonsley existed, and I don't think I'm ever going to use the Bonsley in Let's Play. Bonsley has been kind of cool, I think. First Pseudo Rudo, because it's the one I used, and I used it in the Elite Four of Pokemon Gold. Eventually, I'm going to be able to say, oh, I used all of these Pokemon, but for now, I can only say I've used about 50. No, way more than 50. I don't know exactly. At like 90, I would say. Um, it's not your summary I want, it is yours. And what ability did you get with you? Storm Drain! Yes! That's such a good ability! We cannot be hit with water-type moves. If there's a water-type gym, it's game over. Is that a Pikachu? What is a Pokeball here? X Accuracy. Very nice. Um, hello there, Pikachu. Are you okay? Hi hi, I'm a Pokemon! What? 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 It's a child! Oh my wee heart. That scared me. That really, really scared me. Finion, you are not doing this battle. What's a female Pikachu? I could tell before it came out. I am I'm a Pokemon Master. Not yet. I'm only gonna call myself Pokemon Master when I've used every Pokemon. I should stop saying that at this point. 
because it's going to get boring if I just keep repeating it. And it's also going to get boring if I just keep saying it's going to get boring to different aspects. But anyway, um, this Let's Play I feel like has been going a bit strange so far. Um, I, I've really been enjoying it, obviously, but of course, this is my first time using an emulator, now I'm going to know it better. So the Let's Play after this, which isn't an emulator Let's Play, but it's another Let's Play, not a Nuzlocke or anything. I've already got it planned out. It's going to take like, I reckon, about 30 episodes. This one might take up like 50, with everything that's going on. It might become the new longest Let's Play on my channel. I don't know. Oh, you angry, Pika child. Well, I'm angry about society. Um, no, we need the potions. How I seal. And we got one. Perfect. And you are healed, Monfano. Go forth, my child. Well, actually, you're not allowed to go forth because I kind of need you. Um, your trainer. Hello. Listen, if you don't mind, I'd have a battle with your Pokemon. I, I do mind actually. I mind very much, in fact. And I'd rather breed a Jennifer. You didn't have a battle with my Pokemon. Please be a super low level mind being you. You know, what? close enough. If you don't can beat this thing up. Actually, Finon does have ridiculously low stats, so let's not overestimate that. But I'm sure, Finon, you're gonna be fine. I believe in you. I think we might need to train up Finon a little bit. So, Finon's gonna be need to be overleveled by the time we fight the Elite Four and Cynthia. Because the one thing I know about this game is that it's probably got the hardest Elite Four out of any, from what I've heard. Which is terrifying. Because I struggled with the Kalos champion. Like, on well, my first play of X and Y, I needed to defeat, I needed to go through Elite Four twice to defeat this champion. And that's like, the easiest Elite Four. Like, I struggle when it comes to these final acts of Pokemon games. Except in Lox. In Lox I do well. But I think that's just a stress. Okay, Kino's actually gonna pull this one off. Okay, <gasps> it's gonna use Water Gun! We're gonna get a Storm Drain! Okay, so, I was wrong about the effects of Storm Drain. It appears that it doesn't, in fact, absorb it. It just means that we get all the water type attacks, but we resist water type, so... It only works in a double battle? Which kinda sucks? Ooh, that XP doesn't suck now. It's a nice amount of XP. Buddy, yum, yeah, we're gonna switch out. Even if it's very low level, we're very weak. Um, Staravia, I guess this one's for you. My overleveled bird. Buddy's cute, I like Buddy. I, I remember Tumblr blog a few years ago. I saw Buddy in it. And it was like my first time seeing a Pokemon on a Mew that wasn't directly related to Pokemon. And I was like, oh my gosh, other people know about this thing too! It's amazing! I've always liked credit for that. Like, introducing the wider world of Pokemon like, with fans all around the globe. Oh no, we might level up. Oh no, we're gonna lose it. No! Okay, I don't think we do lose it yet. Yep. We still have time. I'm just gonna destroy this Pepper. I'm sorry, special one. Your sacrifice will not be in vain. Well, it kind of will be, but that doesn't matter. You're dead now. Oh wait, is this gonna... No! I won, but at what cost? Ooh, what? Well, you know what I should do? I should take screenshots, like... Now? Ooh, wait! Welcome to family, your son. So that would be perfect for the old keystone. We can get spiritual in this game now? Um. <gasps> oh, I said yes! Many years ago. Wait, um.
Why? Hello? Why can't I access that? Oh, you get our bike. Oh, no, we don't. If we're sneaky, we don't need to. Um, I thought we were going to get Spirit Tomb, but I was wrong. Okay, Gen 4. I love this gen, because it started me off on Pokemon, but... Starly and Bidoof are everywhere. It's ridiculous. Like, it seems excessive. See? We don't need Starly everywhere in this game. We just don't. I'm sorry. We've already got one. Good enough. We're done with that Pokemon now. Okay, so there's a tower there. Um, Celestion Town. I'm gonna heal up and then head back and deal with those guys again. Like, those other guys, closer guys. So, and not another town, like, shouldn't that, so there should be more gyms. Like, eight hours into the game and we've only gotten two badges. Which is like, fine, I'm fine with long games. They're the best kind of games. But even this seems excessive. Oh, hello. You're not supposed to intrude on my time with Sue. Huh? You wanna battle with me? Oh, I can team with Ty. I don't know why, but I like, forgot the ability to read during that time. Ah, a couple Ty and Sue. I remember when I was an. Oh, wait, I've never been. Sue Dark? Oh, this is the perfect matchup! We both have flying type moves! Ty and Sue, I'm so sorry. This isn't gonna be pretty. I think Gus hits both of them too. Ooh, it hits Staravia as well. Staravia, I'm sorry about this, but you can take it. Um, uh, who's the bigger threat? I think Med type is. And that's gonna be definitely a one shot. Okay. And this Gus is gonna do practically nothing, but it's some chip damage. Fideon doesn't quite level up. That's annoying. Ooh, actually, it's okay. Who are you seismic tossing? Who are you tossing seismic clay? Okay, sorry, but that's fine. Okay, gust again, and then wing attack again. Cool, we're done. The deed is done. What give these people the right just like show up and be like, hey, there's two of us and one of you, we're gonna beat you up. Just cruelty. That's that's all it is. I mean, oh, 151. Nice. Ty and Sue. I only advise for Sue. Maybe that's why we lost. I'm sorry, Ty. I'm breaking up with you because of this. No, don't leave me. Too dark? Maybe. Ooh, Pokemon. Starly? Bidoof? Bebow. Should have seen this one coming. But it doesn't evolve at level 16, do they? Do they? Do they? Have an existential crisis. Ooh, that's not good. No, 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 that is not acceptable. Run. Oh, I love that running noise. That's like ASMR. Oh, so nice. And we can cut this down. Chop, chop. This item better be worth it. Actually, that's okay, I can give that to Saravia. I might give it to them later. Oh no, you look important. Ooh, um, ghost types, I'm gonna assume. Uh, I'm not gonna go in there quite yet. Oh wait, there was another trainer down here, we forgot. We must do everything in the game, or we might as well not play it. Hi there, where are you from? What kind of Pokemon have you got? That was a terrible southern accent. It was an attempt at a southern It wasn't even an attempt. It wasn't even in the same ballpark as a southern accent. That's a lot of Pokemon, Shelly. Um, water gun. Come on, you're five levels above the sink. It's a stab move. It's not resisted. 
At least half HP. Okay, well, Fenil's gonna have to be very over level for this game. But they can at least take out a Bidu. And isn't that really the first step towards success? Bidoof domination. Once you take it off the Bidoof, once you can take out a Bidoof and a Bibao, you can take out half of the Pokemon in Sinnoh. Because they are half the Pokemon in Sinnoh. I don't know if I need to explain that joke. But we all know jokes get funny whenever you explain them, so it's win win. Have a. Send out like a rock fight. Is there a rock fight type? I know Colossal is, but. Colossal wouldn't show up for another 4 gens. Is there a rock fight type? I may have just figured out the pattern for um, Pokemon sequels. Like, I might be very wrong about this. We're going to do this while we beat up this thing. So, Fire Red and Leaf Green came out for Generation 3, but they came out before um, Ruby and Sapphire, I'm pretty sure. So if that's when they came out, they pretty much came out just after Gen 2. So you double it. Double one to get two. I'm going full conspiracy theorist, but it's fine. Because you've watched 16 minutes into the video, you're either fainted on the floor and can't stop the video, in which case I'm very sorry, or you're actually enjoying this. So you're probably tied up on the floor or something. But, anyway. Um, then Hard Gold and Soul Silver came out in Gen 4, twice of Gen 2. Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire came out in Gen 6 twice of Gen 3. The reason we didn't get Gen 4 remakes in Gen 7 is because it wasn't twice. We're going to get Gen 4 remakes after these next games. After um the thing for Sword and Shield come out. Does this lady really have a team of 6 Bidoofs? How many Bidoofs? 5 Bidoofs. I mean, I'll respect the hustle, but seems excessive again. We might win this fight, because that's going to do nothing. It did 4 damage. Okay, that's slightly more than nothing. So if this takes it down enough for us to KO it next turn, I think it just barely does. This is 7. Yep, okay. Come on, Fidion, you got to knock it out. You can do this. Finish the Bidoof. Yes! Killing Bidoof's left, right, and center. We got a super annoying beeping noise. I'm not gonna go crazy from this. You are. Me going crazy, that'd be preposterous. So I'm gonna assume this is quite like a. Like the final Pokemon in the game aren't gonna be that high a level, like probably 50s, early 60s. Because, I mean, we're this far in and the Pokemon are only level 20. Okay, they're gonna set up a defense skull on us. So, it's not going to save you from the Mac Punch! Which is remember it only has the same power as Rock Smash, so maybe I should have just Rock Smash because that could also lower defense, but the thing's dead anyway, so it never, it doesn't matter. Damn, it doesn't matter with it. is not going to level up from that. Okay, Cowgirl Shelly, um, I can see that your favorite Pokemon is obviously Beedoo. You might want to try like a different strategy, or just evolve one of them. A Bebel would be better than a Bidoof. Okay, we get the knockout, nice. The is done. The Bidoof is dead. Okay, so that's done, and now we can heal up at the Pokemon Center. Okay, so now we're going to go through this town and kind of talk to everyone, and then I think we'll go through the Pokemon Tower. But I think talking to everyone in this town is just going to take most of the rest of the episode. It's fair distance from Celestion Town to Veilstone City. I suppose you can rest at the cafe, but that place... Ooh, wait, what's up with the cafe? I'm interested. The day command was saying Pokemon grow at different rates. Ooh, so the day cares around here. I really don't feel the need to breed my Pokemon right now, shockingly. 
breathing in this refreshing air. It even perks up Pokemon, that's why I'm out here. Your encounters with Pokemon can be considered your shared history. Here's a Poké trap called Pokemon History. You see your Pokemon in them. Okay, well thanks for that addition to something I'm never really going to use. I'm too little, I don't know how to battle very good. The very nice thing is raising my Pokemon for me. This sounds like a Team Rocket scheme. Every Sunday I visit the Lost Tower. Howdy, Traveling Trainer. This is a gym in this town, you'll be one in Veilstone or Pastoria. Yep, I will. Used to be nothing here, but the road that went straight through. Over time, pe Pokemon and people just gathered and this town came to be. It's like a Minecraft town. Or like how I build my Minecraft towns. I'm the daycare man. Look after the precious Pokemon. Oh, that's true. Your Pokemon. Have a word with my wife. I will go into here to see if you have like an egg or something. Doesn't seem like it. Um, can you give me something, please? Pokemon for you? No, I'm good, thank you. Like, how much can Pokemon in the daycare level up? Like, could I use it as like a leave a Pokemon there, come back for the Elite Four, and it'd be ready? Or no? Um, Pokemon. I think we're good on supplies, and we can't get full heals yet. I'll just talk to you. Use a pallet keeps weak Pokemon away. So I'm gonna hurry. Yeah, it is. Seal case. I can't buy any seals here. Was that the spelling of seal that was like literally the animal? The seal? Okay, um. Go go into these two houses. And I guess this town isn't too big because, of course, it's a town. Three things! They say no one has ever seen a Pokemon actually lay eggs. So the two in the Pokemon actually lay eggs. Oh, okay. Every so often, an egg will be found in the Pokemon daycare. And they're found without anyone knowing how they got there. Is someone leaving them there? I like Game Freaks sidestepping around anyone mentioning more mature Pokemon content. Very sneaky. Very sneaky. Sinnoh so, you know, is tiny but has many fans. The newspaper's printed right here. Okay. Oh, welcome! You saw no one's outside, but it's hiring, right? Is that a Pokedex there? You must know Professor Rowan! You're just a Pokemon searching expert right? so we've been looking for. Cookshoon, I want you to bring me one. Bring it today, or we're not going to be able to run our main article. Remember, it has to be today, before the date rolls over. Well, dude, I'm very sorry. You are on your own. Uh, I can't- I'm not going to help you there. Maybe another day. Okay, so there was a lot of stuff over this way. I'm going to check out the other house first. Bet you there's free items. I'm not gonna go and catch a Pikachu. Oh, I've always welcome to you guys. Okay. And is this the next route? Yeah, so we've got a lot of stuff to do in this town. Okay. This seems like such a weird way to place to put your house. Pokemon is an Adam and Angel. You know Pokemon take determines how it will grow. Yes, I did know that. I've been a little bit of competitive battling in the past. This area had many Pokemon from the olden days. I said there were big Pokemon ranches around these parts. Pokemon Cowboys. Wait, we just saw a Cowgirl. Of course it's Pokemon Cowboys. Ooh, secret, secrets, secrets, no secret, no secrets. Okay, we're gonna have to run through that like three or four times at least. Ooh, just went night time. Because it just turned six. So six is nighttime in the Pokemon world. That explains a lot. You can customize Pokeballs by fixing steel to them. Oh, do I have a steel case? Well, here you go. Ooh, thank you. And bell capsule is a piece of it. Next, use a capsule and buy steel so as you wish. When you're done, put the capsule on a Pokeball. Okay. Gotta go through it again. Gotta find all the little secrets. I mean, a seal case is a mighty was seal. Oh, wait, did we already go down? Yes, we went down this one. So it's just this one left. Ooh, there's a cave! Hello? Salacian Ruins? <gasps> Unknown! Okay, um. Let's read this. Top, right, lower, left, 
top right, lower left, top right again, top left, I should write this down. So it was, um, was a piece of paper, top right, lower left, top left, T right, lower left, top left, top left again, lower left, okay so, top right is this one, Oh, there's gonna be trainers in here. Oh no. Hi. Something really weird about these ruins. That's why I like coming here, but come just have to. I'll give you some neat seals. Okay, peace, dude. Lower left. That's this one. I'm gonna mess up my directions and it's gonna be embarrassing. Of course there's a trainer in here. Something mean to this. Who's out there? Some of you says by battling you. Okay, so we're up. We need top left after this. Beat this dude up. Do I want an unknown on my team? I mean, eventually I'm gonna want to use one. The question is, do I want it now? Oh, Finneon's actually gonna beat this guy up. Because we have four times super effective moves. Okay. Yes, Finneon! Getting a one shot. Nice. Yes, another Geodude! We'll deal with it accordingly. Okay, so we're on top left, this next thing we need. Ooh, Bonzo, wait, um... I'm going to go into Monferno for that. I could send out my own Bonzor, but I feel like Monferno is just better suited for the occasion. Hopefully the thing doesn't have heat proof. I really hope it's got levitate. Oh, Confuse! That's just annoying and wastes my time. I'm going to win. Just let me win. Come on. Come on, Monferno. Break through the confusion. You can do this. Apparently you can't do this. Okay, now it's gonna beat you up. I feel like a river song. Like scolding the doctor and um not river song. Madam Master no not Madam Master. The eye patch lady in um A Good Man Goes to War. It's my favourite episode of the whole show, I can't remember her name. Um like when she says she's scolding him at the very end and he it's like, okay, why are you scolding me? And then oh, oh. I meant to say, oh shoot, but now I'm going to have to censor that. 29.30. 28.30. I'm very... Did they just put me to sleep? This is... This episode is a disaster. Um... Mr. Avia, please fix the problem. I'll... Okay, got to remember to censor this episode as well. Okay, we've got a few problems to deal with, it seems. We'll get to the bottom of this, see what's there. Because I don't actually know, Wing Attack, and this thing's going to resist it because Steel is an annoying type. But Bonzong's probably my favourite Steel type. Oh my, that did negative damage. Oh my, we're going to lose to a Bonzong. Bonzong. We're going to lose to a Bonzong. A bronzor. You know, I plan out these episodes because I have a lot of things that I need to do, and I can only record these for like an hour a day. Before I get, I'm too tired at night. I can only edit then, and it's super loud the rest of the time. So I kind of need these episodes to end after 30 minutes. 
because I want to get these out daily. But this Bonzo appears to have other ideas. Just confusing and sending us to sleep. The audacity. Come on, Monferno, wake up. Wake up, you ought to hit it. Well, that's going to do a lot. Oh, no, it doesn't do that too much. And I will not use a potion in battle. That's just the thing I've always had. It's unfair. Even if they use potions and full restores, it's unfair to use one of those, in my mind, in battle. Because we can do these battles as many times as we want. The NPCs only get one shot. And once you beat them, they're kind of dead, aren't they? Yes, Monfano! No! Don't hit yourself in confusion! Hit the flame wheel! No! Oh my gosh, we just lost one shot. Okay. Um, we're gonna lose the fight. I think. We're gonna back out to a bonzo. But we have one thing that you do not expect! Time to fight fire with fire, sending out our own Vonzo. Use hypnosis. I shouldn't have hypnosis. I should have used imprison. If he uses imprison now, I didn't think this through. Now Vonzo's gonna die. Vonzo, wake up and use imprison. Come on, you'll do it. This is me snapping my fingers to convey urgency. Okay, that's one time of sleep. Okay, you gotta respect. This man's got a strategy, and he sticks to it. Come on, Bonds, you gotta wake up. You gotta wake up. Okay, didn't use. Okay, we can take as many confusions as there are minutes in the day. Okay, so we can take 58 more confusions, but there aren't 58 more confusions. Come on, don't use. No! He played us like a fiddle! Um... We have to wake up, switch out, switch back in, because I think that cancels... Um... In prison. But we still have extra sensory! Sucker! We're confused. Oh my. Okay, we're gonna need to send in someone to, like, die. And then hope that cancels out. Okay, Pokemon. Staravia. We switch in Staravia, then we switch in Bronzor. And just hope that that works. This will mean Bronzor will only be able to use Confusion. We're gonna be. If we're not careful, we're gonna be swept by Bronzor. Yeah, I got a crit. Um, okay. Now Pokemon into Bonzo, because Finneon can't win this fight. We just know that. Like, I came into this fight five minutes ago thinking, hey, you know what? This fight's going to be easy. Look at these two Geodudes. He sends out a Bronzor who's two levels lower than the lowest member of my team. And he is beating me up. No! Imprison doesn't work like that. Um, just use extra sensory then. We're just going to have to outlast them. Please do a lot of damage. Oh my. Yes, it missed. Okay. Come on, Bonzo. You got this, buddy. Fight through the pain and the rubber ducks. Victory is forever. Rubber ducks are temporary. My glasses are... Maybe it's just because I stare at screens the whole time, but my eyesight's going. I'm 16 and I'm going to need my third new prescription of glasses soon. So, there's some information. I, it's because I like a screen so much. I think if you look in books, it'll be fine. But again, I don't know. But like, what are you meant to do if you're not meant to look at screens and books during what the world's going through right now? I honestly think Bonzo is our best bet here because... Um, at least we can go through these. Yeah, look, we can take hits. Um, I'm gonna look up how much PP Confusion has, because, guys, remember, if we lose this... Yes, okay, um... 
Okay. Confusion Pokemon move. Oh, we just hit ourselves in confusion again, didn't we? Because we went down there. Yeah. Twenty-five PP. How much more do you have? How are we doing nothing? Nothing. This one's is gonna have to rely on us hitting ourselves. I can't believe this has turned into a war of attrition. Like we win the war of attrition, I think. Unless they like continuously use hypnosis and whittle us down, we can get very lucky. Oh my god. I'm losing my mind. Um Let's switch out. Staravia, we're gonna give you a shot here. See if you can do a bit more. We're going so much over the episode limit. Like I have to go down to make dinner soon. I'm getting flashbacks. My first ever Let's Play on the channel was through a Roblox game called Pokemon, Roblox Pokemon Project, and in that game, double team. No, I'm just gonna try to wake up and wing attack. I see to hit it. In the game, um, there was one character who had a Chansey who kept using Minimize again and again and again. And in that episode, like, I spent a solid half of the episode just trying to beat up that Chansey. Come on. Staravia, you gotta wake up! If you haven't noticed, we're kind of struggling here. Oh, and this thing can hit Staravia hard. Like, harder than it can hit Bonzor. Because it's neutral. Yeah, it's just gonna keep eating us up. We're down to half HP. Our team was healthy when he went into this. Staravia, wake up! Come on! We're in the th 20s. Yes? Don't. Don't! Oh my. Um, okay. We've got no choice but to double team. I've got a... It's not the best strat, and it's not the nicest strat, but... You know what? It's better than losing to a Bronzor. Come on, Staravia. Use Wing Attack! Don't hit yourself. Do not hit yourself. Do n Guys, we're about to be swept by a Bronzor. The ones are sweeping us. Those were our two super over level Pokemon. We still got one thing left. Ah, Bronzor. Oh my god. Okay. I've been here for 10 minutes. But I can't leave recording this. Like, they either need to knock me out. Something needs to happen. But I don't know what. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Bonzo, you gotta wake up. Buddy, you. It's because I didn't click in prison. If I'd clicked in prison, we would have been out of here by now. But I messed up, and now we're about to be. Absolutely slam dabbed. Which is British slang, I believe. I don't know, it might not be. Yes? No. 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 What are the odds of hitting yourself in confusion? If this person uses a potion. Oh my god. We've been here for 10 minutes. 12 minutes. Okay, 
chip damage. Yes! We can punch them. Okay, that's not that sucks. Bonzo's about to bring us to half HP. We don't lose this fight, Bonzo. Are we clear? You do not let us lose this fight. Yes! Yes! Crit! Crit him! It was a low damage roll. But okay. Okay. Ha! We do one damage. Bring us down to 30%. Like 50%. So you've brought us down to 50%. You underestimate our Bonzo's power. So the thing is, simultaneously, I'm falling in love with Bonzo as a Pokemon because of how ridiculous this battle is and our Bonzo being the only thing that can stand up to their Bonzo. But on the other hand, I'm getting really pissed at Bonzo because of their Bonzo. I'm emotionally conflicted here, guys. This Pokemon will hold a special place in my heart after this. Come on. Yes. Oh, it's not even in red yet. So we've got Finion in the back. Yes! Failure! Come on, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself. Yes, Bonzo! Bring it down to red! The day will be ours! Okay, so... Apparently the day will not be ours today. This episode is going to go over an hour long. Hey, do you remember the time I swore earlier in the episode? Yeah. So naive back then. How much more PP could confusion have? Don't hit yourself. Yes! Get the extra sensory off. Come on! Come on, we're so close! Come on! That's like three more extra sensories. We're already confused, sucker. Not sure why I'm bragging about that. Come on. No! Okay, so. They're gonna drop us below 20. But as long as they don't consistently. I think they might actually be out of confusion. Because they're not using it anymore. Right? I think they're out. I think they're solely relying on us, repeatedly hitting ourselves in confusion. Because they can't do anything else. And when it fails, doesn't like, confuse her run out? Yes? Yes! Yes! Crit it! Crit it! Come on, Bronzor! This is the most intense trainer battle of my life. And it's gonna miss! And I'm out of confusion! This is it! This is our chance! Come on, Bonzo! Get us out of this one! Yes! We did it! We did it! We did it! We survived. Shut up, Carl. No, I'm leaving. I am out. Adios. They utterly flabbergasted half of my team. More than half. Imagine if he whipped out of like a slightly higher level bronzor. Thank you all so much for watching this episode of our Pokemon Diamond Let's Play. I hope you all have a dog-tastic day. I'll see you in the next episode, and ODF out. Goodbye.